favorite song I ever wrote right here. And I wrote it with a beautiful Lisa Carver. And I gotta tell you something about this day. Uh, this was one of the days where, when you, see, when you're a writer and you, you write for publishing companies, they, they will put you in these rooms and it's kind of like dating. Uh -huh. And they put you in these rooms and, and they'll go, is there any possibility that you could be creative Thursday at 10 o'clock <laughs> and write us a song that will sell millions of copies uh, and we need that? Um, would it make it good? Can you do that? And we smile, and uh, in the back of our mind, we're thinking, you can just kiss my butt. And, <laughs> and sometimes it works. But it creates a, a pressure sometimes that, that um, if, if you're not careful and you don't fight for the art part and the reason that you got into songwriting and into music in the first place, you will, you will catch yourself just going down this road of trying to write things that people will cut on the radio and it all sounds like shit if you do that. <laughs> You have to write from a heart place. And the whole reason that I came to this town was to write songs because I felt like I had a story that nobody else could tell. You could memorize my story and you could tell other people and you can make people cry, but you will never tell my story like I can. And I felt that one when I came to town and I had uh, just finished, um, I had just finished uh, Uncle Buzzy, as I said, I was looking for new material and I, and I and uh, Lisa Carver and I, we got in there and we started wrestling over this idea of what's something great. And I caught my, and she caught me fixing lines. Like, well, I don't think a middle-aged person would want to say this. Well, I don't think the girls would want to say this. Well, I don't think, and she says, what the hell are you doing, Madagoose? Stop it. And I said, well, I mean, I'm, I'm worried that, the, she, I didn't come here to write a radio song. I came to write something meaningful to us. So can we do that, please? Can you stop this madness? And when she gave me permission to be me, um, then we wrote what I think is one of the best songs that I've ever had the privilege of being a part of. And I love you for that, Miss Carver. I really do. That was a big day for me.
Wish I need to catch you, maybe tired. I ain't leaving waiting. Unfinished business. I've got kisses that'll still ain't kissed. Few more things I need to do.